Back with uh, Sean and Natalie for round three of the uh, British Candy Taste Challenge. Yes. Um, I've actually toned down on this one. I think the first box I sent you was about 20, 20 <laughs> on items. So much. <laughs> and, uh, it was so much. Yeah. It then, was uh, a lot. Yeah. 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 a couple of the old favourites. Yeah, so the, there's one item that they, they both like, so it's the Starburst and the Bounty. Mm. Um, I, brought, I brought the dark chocolate version. Yep. And uh, see how they like their ones. Yeah. We're going to start with the nerds. Now, I know these are American yeah. and they've been imported to the UK from America. Okay. But the reason we got these ones uh, were because of the stuff in the back. Okay. So, when we sent you the last set of chocolate, Natalie was mentioning about all the different description about what's in the mm -hmm. chocolate. And I know we've got to have an extra on. label on the top with all the nutritional information yeah. to meet UK guidelines. Uh, and we learned from our first, from the first package they send us that when it says GB or IRL on these, it means Great Britain and Ireland. Yeah, yeah. yeah which I didn't know beforehand. Yeah, you guys have to label so much more. Yeah, so anything imported into the UK, food-wise, has got to have all the the right classifications and description I take it. on the back. Yeah, yeah. I would never have known that this might contain egg. <laughs> When I saw that earlier, I was like, may contain EGG. I wonder what EGG is. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, it must be another British abbreviation. <laughs> I'm so confused. I, I think you tried to. Were you going to Google it as well? No, but I thought she said like ECG or something. I didn't know it was EGG. But I was still wanting to know. I don't want to share how you just do one side <laughs> slide. Okay, this is the watermelon. I haven't had nerds in a long time. I feel like I'm not doing this right, but that'll work. You're bad at candy. Yeah. And I've never had nerds. <gasps> Let's get some really? Of, of course, we already made it. <clears throat> Blind on that, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we're doing a ritual together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need some Mountain Dew to wash this sugar down. <laughs> Quite sour, aren't they? I like them. Mm. I like it. Oh, it's mm -hmm. sour. It's a good tart. I might have to get these more often. Mm. Other side. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> mmm. That's really good, actually. See, I like nerds. I just feel bad eating nerds because I know it's killing my teeth. <laughs> so very cheesy. Oh, yeah. Well, that was a lot. Maybe we should take all the leftover candy and Mountain Dew and put it in a blender. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I should have some wild Indians. Mm. Mm. I like that one better. Yeah, I was gonna say I like cherry better. Yeah. Mm. Cherry is better. Mm. But the watermelon's good. I think this one's better. I Actually, concur. It kind of has an aftertaste of like medicine though. Yeah. No. Ah. Oh. Actually, that's really good. strong. Yeah. Mine's fine. Tastes good. But I think I associate grape with medicine, but I don't recall getting cherry as much. Okay, those are checked off. Yeah. So we're gonna jump straight into uh, rock next. Okay. Rock candy, so it's crunchy. Um, it, it's, how would you describe it? It's just like, hard, it's it's a hard it can candy. be quite chewy though, can't it, in the middle? Yeah, so normally if it's fresh rock, it's quite hard. When it starts to go past its sell by date, it goes quite chewy. Okay. But sometimes it's even better when it's chewy. Okay. Uh, but it's a traditional uh, seaside treat. Ooh. Yeah. I think some some of them you can get to be soft. Do you know what you like? Do you like? We're gonna say. Uh, well, you can either br break it, it or breaks. you can you can have it on like a, a popsicle. Ugh. Raspberry, raspberry ripple. ripple. Now this is the stuff that's right. sticking yes. your teeth. Yes. Okay. Do you have rock here in the States? Rock. Uh, it's we have, called licorice. 
right. Well, it's called uh, it's called candy canes. I we guess. don't have this. We have things that uh, we have some rock candies, and then we have like licorice type of stuff that's filled kind of like this. Mm -hmm. But it's not. We don't have this like, candy that I've seen. This kind of looks like kazoozles, but it's not soft enough. Yeah. Maybe a piece of this. One. Did you try yours already? No. Oh. Wait, which one are we trying first? What did you try? Oh, this one. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I'll yeah, try some. Chocolate. Yeah. The best, the best oh, version there is um, aniseed, aniseed rock. That's the best tasting one. I really like, I like this. Well, it's done. No, we. I don't think I've had something like that before. Mm -mm. Hmm. I was like. Um, Actually, I don't think I like it that much. It's like not that I dislike it, but. I think it just tastes like sugar to me. Yeah, it's pure sugar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's... I mean, it is sweet. sugar, but I think I was expecting a little more flavor. You wanted, what, some jalapeno on there or something? <laughs> <laughs> some of them, like, yeah. you, can, you can get the aniseed one and you can get, like, a mint one. So some of them are meant to be flavored. Oh, okay. Other ones are just sugar. Sweet. Mm. This one actually tastes a little bit more like a... Like a toffee type of thing, Jamie. Which I really like that. So, but it had like I like the the consistency. You ready? The raspberry. Oh, I like that. Oh, it went softer. <laughs> hmm. I like the consistency. I actually like the flavor of the first one, but it. I like this one better. Really? Hmm. Just to I think argue it's a bit with me? softer. Isn't I think it? just having it a little I'm more soft and chalky is. Oh, no, my first one was softer than my second one. Yeah. Mm. That's what. I'm gonna go like. I feel like <laughs> a candy <laughs> Like a vampire. Mm -hmm. A candy vampire. Mm -hmm. That's why it just gets stuck in your teeth. It does. Yeah. That's why I don't eat butterfinger hair. It gets stuck in my teeth. <laughs> mm. What's next? Go for the next one. I'm not sure we're doing next now. I think we should leave the pear drops till afterwards, you know, so it'll take a while. It's like a hard sweet. Yes, so. yeah. You've had the, the normal bounty. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we'll go for the, the dark bounty. Still yes. it. Now the, the dark one is a lot harder to get hold of in the UK. It's only okay. sold in. Yeah, a while ago the you the it was everywhere. used to be there, yeah. More specialty. Yeah, mm. but now it's just the You wait. Oh. <laughs> I see you eye in the prize. What is good? Excited. Quite rich now, chocolate can smell it. Oh, yeah, you can smell mm. that dark chocolate. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Ready? I'm not, oh, yeah. I, don't, I don't like coconut. Why? <gasps> <laughs> 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 <I'm> cheating. Mmm, <laughs> right. that's good. Oh, yes. That's good. See, I love chocolate. Like, Sean really likes hard candy. I'm always a chocolate person. I like chocolate too. Mm -hmm. It's just not my the only thing I like. Mm. Mm. That's really good. Don't That's some of the best coconut. dark chocolate I've had in a while. The, the dark chocolate and coconut go really well together. I like bounties. I wish we had bounties here. I would buy them. Yeah, I think they're because I think they're better than almond joy, which is mm -hmm. the American coconut candy bar. Though. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of almond. But if Almond Joy wants to sponsor a video, I'll go ahead and do something like too. <laughs> Send me an email. So, would you like to try the that one? I'll just save that one for another time. I'm fine with either. Mm, let's save it. Yep. Part of me wants to eat it, and part of me is like, man, I've had so much sugar. <laughs> <laughs> um, should we try the yes. after eight? So, this is the after eight ones. So, normally in the UK, it's a small little wafer chocolate. Um, which you normally have after, after, dinner after your meal. Mm. Yeah. Uh, but these are like a little square block. So this is like a... Like I think a you have something similar, don't you? The, like the 
chocolate mints. Uh, yeah. Andy's mints. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay. Don't have this one, John. Yeah. I'm jealous. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay, I'll go buy myself some Andy's mints or something. <laughs> mm. You know? It has the same consistency as the York mints here. Mm. Okay. But just that it doesn't, I mean, it looks different. That's really good though. I like that. So, like, in the UK, they come in a big box of like wafer, basically, mm -hmm. wafers, chocolates. Just like little thin squares. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. My mum normally buys it for Christmas for me. And they're only gone. They're gone within a day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was good this year, though. Yeah, it it lasts you like three days this year. Yeah. But normally they're gone. You open it first thing Christmas morning, buy lunch, and uh, <laughs> they're gone. Oh, yeah. those are delicious. That was good. And it freshened my breath. I enjoyed it terribly. <laughs> <laughs> what we'll do, we'll go for Sean's favourite. So the Starburst. <laughs> but this is uh, the UK version. Which is way better than the American version because they put so much more fruit juice in theirs. Yeah, you, Starburst used to be my favourite candy, but now Starbursts are my second favourite candy and UK Starbursts are my favourite candy. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> okay, okay. Oh, there, we go. there we go. Here, I'll just keep my little stack, and every time you have uh, a lot of candy I can't have, I'll eat, I'll eat a Starburst. Okay. Is there another red one? Let's put one there. I'll eat the black current one first because that's always my least favorite. <laughs> I do the same thing. I choose my favorite. What is a current? Blackcurrant. Is it like a berry? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's the flavor of I should know like that. I know that they juice. have them here. I just. It's not a popular flavor here. What do we have here? Are we going for the, the purple ones? Mm -hmm. I'm going for purple since so okay. uh, Natalie did it. <laughs> Does anybody else comment down below if you use your teeth to open them up? Because it's no. just so much harder to do they it with don't. your fingers. They don't, because normal people don't bite their nails up. <laughs> I like black currant. I think it's good. It. However, <laughs> I have a feeling that this one's going to be my favorite. The, the green one is now lemon and lime, but about ten years ago, and prior to that, it used to be it used to have a separate lemon and a lime one, and mm -hmm. we didn't have the black currant. I wish they'd go mm -hmm. back to that. Yeah. This reminds me of a chapstick I used as a kid. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going for orange next. So I'll give you a orange. Your green one. Right? Orange. Mm. I like that purple one. It's different. I think it's just because we have so much of it, you know, flavoured, blackcurrant flavoured things in mm -hmm. the UK. It's kind of like your grape, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I don't like American grape flavoured candy because it tastes like medicine to me. I really like the Japanese, have good Japanese grape, flavor. grape flavoured candy mm -hmm. because it tastes like grapes. Oh, what is this? It's orange. Orange. Just straight orange, huh? Mm -hmm. And it tastes more like the uh, actual orange juice. Mm. Yeah, you can taste the um, the orange, the citrus in mm -hmm. there, like the actual orange. I love the Starburst. <laughs> they do the um, summer fruits as well, don't they? I've gone with the strawberry one, and that's Matthew. We've done it all the same, we've got to continue. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's all still to my teeth now. Yeah, they, they do like, uh, instead of the yellow packets, they do uh, a pink packet. Which is oh, all this like, like strawberry and strawberry and peach and things. Oh, peach? Mm -hmm. And uh, they do a, mm -hmm. a sour flavour as well. Cherry might be my favourite, actually. It's it's strawberry. strawberry. Mm. I just assume red is cherry because everything mm -hmm. red here is cherry. Strawberry is pink. Pink. Mm -hmm. You also taste good when you mix them. Mm. Yeah, you blend them. Have together. you ever melted them over a fire? No. 
Mm -hmm. That's what we do here, kind of like a like s'mores yeah. thing. Then we used to put a starburst on there, and that was it. Mm -hmm. Try them. I think the strawberry one's good. I liked it. It's not like good enough to be life changing. I think uh, orange is my least favorite, but I still thought it was pretty good. Then black currant. Say. Okay. Mm. I think I like the black and black currant. It's different. Mm. Then the strawberry and then the lemon lime. Yeah, lemon lime. Lemon lime and strawberry are just about as good to me. Mm. Oh, that one's good. They're all stuck in my teeth. <laughs> you want to switch? Yeah, um. them two are always <laughs> my favorites. The strawberry and the lemon lime. I'll, I'll have the orange one. And the black one. I feel like this should be a flavor that you have really cold or like iced. Mm -hmm. Like this should go in a snack. You, you want to stick these in your, your freezer mm -hmm. and then put them in a drink later? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> put them in your Mountain Dew later. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Which one would you like to try next? I don't think it's mm. milky powder, but I don't think it's strong enough. That. Well, send them three, four, mm -hmm. Send three, you won't go to Yeah. I've got a caramel as well. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So this is the uh, Nestle's caramel bar. Now I'm out of this. I'm just trying to think how you describe it. It's like a white chocolate, isn't it? But caramel flavor. It's, it's really yeah, nice. Nice. I thought they stopped doing these. I remember I them when I was a kid, but well, I've not seen them for a while. I think all this sugar is making my mouth dry. <laughs> I think it's, it's making my teeth do. My teeth are all a little uh, funny. Excuse me. Sorry. It's just passing. Sorry. Just passing. Every time we have I'm chocolate, stealing this if you don't want it. Every time we have chocolate, I'm like, oh yeah. <laughs> that was delicious. What? what? It that tastes what like, um, it reminds it me. Like, a bit like fudge. Mm. Actually, it's it's got that bit of a gritty taste. Scotch or something. It reminds me of the cookies and cream Hershey's. Oh, interesting. Mm, yeah. Something else I can't eat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that you used to eat. But I used to love them. They were like my most, one of my favorite candy bars when I used to buy them. So that's good. It does taste like that, yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Hit me, baby, one more I'll, I'll just keep eating this. I've had enough sugar that I'm like... You can save that. A part of me is like, I would really like to try that. Another part of me is like, I'll be okay. I just had so much sugar. <laughs> So uh, the uh, next one is the, the double double-decker. Double-decker? Yeah, so it's double wafer, uh, nugget. Oh, nougat. Uh, nougat. That's how you're supposed nougat. to say it. Nougat. This one really didn't make the trip. I've, I've had this one, one before, so I'm okay with this one. Oh, wow. Looks like something oh. you would oh, like. Oh, wow. <laughs> There's like an explosion happening. We are gonna have to vacuum the floor because of you, woman. <laughs> oh wait, oh wait. <laughs> it's all stuck to the thing. No. Oh yeah, Matthew, that is not what it should look like. <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to be quite a nice chocolate bar. <laughs> but, uh... That looks good. How does it? Mm. Well. I like the flavor. The nougat is like really chewy and the crispy part goes away really fast. Okay. Mm, so you're left with mostly chewing the nougat with an occasional crunch from the crispy. Okay. Yeah, it has got a bit of texture of it. It's good. Open intact. I think I like the caramac a bit better mm. so far, but that one's still good. So again, this is a, another Nestle bar. So this is the Milky Bar. It's just white chocolate. It's just white chocolate. This one. Unfortunately, they struggled with the, the heat mm -hmm. coming over. That one almost has a coffee taste to it. 
Yeah, and I can yeah. taste. Yeah, yeah, it's interesting. It's not surviving very well. It's... <sighs> That's okay. <laughs> Do you have white chocolate over here? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. This one is nicest when it's like out the freezer or something, isn't mm. it? When it's really crunchy, this is a bit melted. These come in um, in the bars like that, or they come in little buttons, so a flat little disc. Mm -hmm. And they're really nice. Keep them in the freezer. Actually, uh, yeah, this one does taste like it would be really good cold. Mm. Mm. You like that one? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, we have one more thing to try, and then I'll say my favorite, which may or may not change. Okay. <laughs> so the uh, the last one is the uh, pear drops. Uh, so it's a, a hard candy, uh, which is sweetened and hard boiled. You get it in all the like the old-fashioned sweet shops. Right? Yeah, it's more of a, a traditional. English candy. So it's hard mm -hmm. all the way through. Mm -hmm. okay. Oh, because it looks like it looks a little gummy. gumdrop. And even yeah. though there's two colours, I think they both like they taste the same, it's just the same flavour. It's just I think it is, isn't it, Matthew? Uh no, two different flavours. Oh, it okay. tastes the same to me. Mm -hmm. Which one first? Yellow? Yellow. Yellow first. Oh wow! Oh, wow. <laughs> that's not what I actually expected. Actually, tasting like pear. Yeah, that's after what I having think. all the sugar, 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 and then it just tastes like a fruit. <laughs> uh, no, I like that. I really like mm -hmm. candies that I like taste like. I want it to taste like grape and have some sugar or whatever. Mm -hmm. This tastes that tastes like like a what's well, pear? Is that pear? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, it tastes like pear and it's nice and sweet. I really like this. That's another one I would buy. There's one that's quite similar to these ones called rhubarb and custard. Okay. So again, one's yellow, one's pink. So the pink. Yeah, one side it's yellow, and then one side. So you get both flavors. Oh, so you get the same sweet. Mm -hmm. Nice. But it does take a while to go through. It definitely is helping me like get my spit back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna switch to the pink, and then I'm gonna mix them together. Okay. You don't have to. I'm I just... don't think they are different flavors. I think they're the same. See so what you guys think. Maybe it's two different types of pears. Maybe. The pink doesn't taste as fruity. As the, the pink yellow. doesn't taste fruity to me. It tastes it a more bit more candy. Sour? Yeah, Pretty I think, I think they Sweet. taste differently. Right. Yeah, it doesn't necessarily say, but this tastes more... They're very similar, but the yellow tastes more fruity. Mm. What's your favorite? I think I like the yellow one better out of these two. I do too. But I like them both. What's your okay. favorite out of everything? My favorite out of everything is the Caramac. Really? Yeah. Either, well, it's either this or the After Eight Mints. Okay. Those were really good too, but this one was like really, really good. I really like the Bounty, but I think that my favorite were these two. I like hard mm. candies I can put in my mouth and just suck on for a while. And that has a really good flavor, so I like that. Though this would come in like really close third. The Bounty. Mm -hmm. Like for when you want chocolate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, I like Bounty Bush. What's your favorite, Matt? Mine is Afraid. I mean, because I've not had okay. one in so long, I'd say the caramel too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Boom. <laughs> I liked these, this flavor. I don't really care for this flavor. Yeah, we should have, was... um, if we'd have brought up like the aniseed flavor, I think it would have gone down yeah. better. I do prefer that one. That could be a round four. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, my teeth hurt. And this one, when I ate ten, was harder, and that's something I noticed. I liked it better softer than harder, mm -hmm. so I'd probably do the thing where you buy it and then just let it sit for an extra month or whatever. I like it, it softer, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or if we can buy it, we know it, some of them you buy soft. You know, yeah. You know, mm -hmm. they're going to be softer. Well, it's like not normally, but with, with these sort of candy, when you go to like the, um, the seafronts, they sell a lot in Blackpool and in mm -hmm. Wales. They've actually got writing in the middle. 
Mm -hmm. And it's, it's interesting and it watching... And the same place name you bought in the middle of the room. Yeah, and oh, you can actually see him making it. Yeah. It's a and shame it, it starts off on a, a big block, like that, a big round block. Mm -hmm. You can see each letter, mm -hmm. and gradually oh. it goes smaller and smaller and smaller until it gets to that size. Oh, that's really cool. See, when you said, like, rock, we had rock candy, but most of that is, like, sugar, just, but it's, like, they, they, they'll do something like, oh, I'm trying to remember, I saw this when I was a kid, like, they'll take a, take a cup of this sugar water stuff and then put, like, a string or a stick down below and let it evaporate out, and you end up with, like, this crystallized coat of sugar on it, mm -hmm. and that's what we refer to as rock candy. Oh, yeah, so, usually on yeah. a stick, you can mm -hmm. buy it at, like, a state fair. Yeah, it looks like a, a rock crystal, maybe. like a crystal yeah. rock. Yeah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So when you said rock, that's what I thought you were talking about, but that's definitely not what we would... Well, I don't think we have anything here like that that I've ever had. It's very different. I had to take it out. I was like, oh, this is too much. My mouth is like, no more sugar. <laughs> yep, so that was uh, Americans Trying British Candy Round 3. Um, yes. We're going to have to think of some good things for Round 4 at Christmas time, I think. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> um.